Welcome back, folks. Welcome back to Resident Evil 3 Remake on Black Temple. Let's get on with this. Alright, guys. I have been pondering, right? I've got no bullets for the handgun. It's the shotgun I'm a bit worried about. And I think it's best I add some more firepower. Now, I am going to take the grenade. So I better check what, what weapon, what's it got. Mine rounds. Hmm... Yeah, I think... Yeah, I'll keep a hold of the mine rounds. For now. Oh, what's this? Handgun. Ooh! Wait, that's Tyrell's gun. Where is he, anyway? Yep, now... Crate, okay. Now... These are 9mm. Right, so this is a burst gun. Right, um. <clears throat> right, let's have a look at this gun. Morning, sunshine. You saved my life. I sure as shit didn't. That was all Carlos. He carried you here and he treated you himself. Crazy bastard. Where is he? He went underground. Bard stockpiled the vaccine, enough to give this city some hope. He thinks he can do this by himself. I'm going after him. Wait, did you see the broadcast? They're gonna blow the city sky high. I'm trying to get a hold of someone, anyone with the clearance to stop it. Leave this mess to him. He's a professional. So am I. <laughs> Right. All right. Guess I'm not talking you out of this. The storage facility is underground, beneath this hospital. I've lost contact with Carlos, so expect trouble. Thanks, Tyrell. So that's what he's doing. He's trying to get some help. So let's have a look around, guys, for stuff. Now, this is interesting, because you see, in the previous game, when they were looking for the samples. One of the team members was killed due to a bomb. Now, whether or not that's still going to happen is up for debate. Okay, so it's giving me a lot of handguns. Now, I need to go that way to go down the stairs, by the looks of it, but I'm not yet. There are a couple of locks we need to um, pick first before we go down. Boys, Carlos dispatched. Okay. Now I need to be careful, as we all know, hunters are lurking about. Right, there's one. You know what that means, guys? Magnum's here. But this also puts me into a quandary. I know there's another there's a safe zone upstairs, which I'm going to go to. I wonder. Are you holding the Magnum? Now. We do need to go here. And we do need to go upstairs. Now, I'm assuming we had to go that way to go downstairs. But that is a little later because we want to get all the stuff that was locked up. Right, um. Damn 
Right. Shed a guest. Hunters. Wait. Oh, it's here. Explosive rounds. <clears throat> Thank you kindly. Something in the operating room because it's still red. Oh, a green herb. And gun ammo. Right. Okay, okay. The, the game is probably telling me I can't load up on the lost stuff. So, what I'll do is. I'll take this gun, the grenade launcher, drop off the magnum, and drop off that gun. And I'm running on shoddy shells. As I thought, it needs Jill to open it. But I'm not gonna open it yet. Right. Store. And. Here's the thing, guys. I want to see the man around in case I run into trouble. But I don't think I need them yet. So I'll take the risk. I mean, I know I'm going to fill up one slot already with a herb, because... But given how my pension from getting hurt pretty badly from a lot of stuff is becoming a bit of a problem. <clears throat> I might as well grab the um, herb and then go upstairs. Which I am no doubt going to run into a freaking hunter. Also gotta check that room as well. Yeah, but Carl didn't give her that hunter, huh? Well, I can't say I blame him. I mean, he did kill a lot of the bloody stuff, so he's giving me room to maneuver. Right. <clears throat> Before I go upstairs, what's in the other room? Is there stuff in here? Oh, explosive B. This looks like Nikolai's work. Yes, Jill. You're correct. <clears throat> this is Nikolai's doing. Like I said, most of the UPC don't know he's betraying them. I can't remember if Nikolai is betraying them for Umbrella or he's betraying them for um, a rival group. Because you got to remember, that's what Wesker did <clears throat> in the previous games. He betrayed um, his comrades for not for him. Um, oh my God! I gotta go upstairs. Not for him, um, Umbrella. He he did have Umbrella, but he wanted the combat data to take to another organization. <clears throat> pretty much one of Umbrella's rivals to um, you know, get himself you know pally pally. Actually dead. Yeah, you're dead. Are you dead? Yep. Yeah, right. Get this out, cause in case we have another hunter decide to pay us a visit. <clears throat> there we are. The staff room and the linen room. They've still got places I need to go. I'm not going to get ambushed on the roof. You know, I'm more surprised I've not been ambushed on the roof. I thought I would have been ambushed. Right. <clears throat> First off.
Right. Safe room. Okay. Drop this off. <coughs> Sorry. Oh, I can make acid rounds. I look into that later. dead are you nope you're not dead now you're dead all right where was the lock again oh yeah it was over here me. All right, what we got here? Shells. Oh. Okay. Yeah, bugger off. Okay. Right, I need to go around yeah, round down and around yeah to the living room so I can um Wait, that window leads to there, but the window I want You're still dead. They're still dead, good. Right. Okay. Ooh, Magnum rounds, more of them. So that indicates to me, guys. Try this one. It's the other window. Right. I'm going to get that case, guys, because that case. Right. So let me look at this in the more broader perspective. That there, if we look at the second floor, the linen room one. The sick room and the cheating room have got something in there because they've got red. So there's something in those two. And the courtyard has something here as well. So. So it's the other one on the other side, right? I got it. Right, right. So I don't need the other two, but I do need the other one. 